Yo, 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 what's going on, y'all? This is your boy, Rondell. Uh, we got, who we got today? 072 Newski, what's that word for? Man, I, I, how, was, was Newski given to you, or was it just something you came up with? Uh, honestly, it's like, it's 50-50 food, like, uh, my name, you know what I mean, like, it, it comes from my real name, food, you know what I'm saying, I ain't gonna say that out, out here, food, but. It come from my real name. My parents used to call me Nunu, and then after that, for people on the block used to call me Nooski. So it just, you know, man, gotcha, I used to gotcha. call myself Nooski. You feel me? That's how it is. So for the people that don't know too much about you, like, um, tell us a little bit of background of you. Uh, so I'm from 72nd and Audison. For I, growing up, I used to chill on 73rd, right there on uh, Damien and shit like that, but. Over time, you know what I mean, uh, me and my friends, we kind of like got together and just, you know what I mean, started writing music and shit. Uh, it started off with my shorty Splack, RP, my shorty Splack, I ain't gonna lie. I got some new music coming from him, shorty, some unreleased shit coming real soon on Phone Up. It's gonna be on my, my new EP coming soon. Uh, what else, for Like, I ain't gonna lie, I'm straight to the point, for just a regular dude from Chicago, for Phone Up. Just out here trying to survive. Alright. It's my quiet ass little brother right here too, fool. Like, you know what I mean? What's going on? What's the word? What's the word? Man, it's what did they from the fucking deuce, man. Niggas know who it is, man. So be, living in Chicago, like you hear the term like uh, the deuce. there's deuce is from this from seventy seven second, right? Hey, for like that, that that's that's a confusion everybody like to like bring up for business. Seventy second out there, out, I think out west or some shit like for they call themselves the deuce too, shorty. Hey, the only real deuce is the one across western on phone them grave, shorty. The only real deuce. We the ones who started school, all that like all that school you had going across the city on fourth grade, we started that. Trans my nigga. Transsetters for real. Is. Anybody you hear screaming school right now today, shorty, that they got that from the dudes on phone now. Now with people that may not like is not familiar with Chicago uh slang, what what is a school? Man, uh, it can mean school. it can mean a lot of shit. Yeah. It depends like, on how you school, say it. A school is really like just who you are as a person on phone now. Like like if you really like like let's say you you really you really into it with music, fool, right? You know what I'm saying, shorty? Like, you really, you scoom about this. On first grade, like, something you really put your all, all into, fool, with food, yeah. Something you scoom for, on first grade. Scoom me in yeah, a lot nigga of like, Yeah, nigga like me, I only know one type of scoom, on gang. Okay, okay. Yeah, gotcha, you gotcha. So, that? how was this whole thing formed, like, as such as, like, your rap career? What was that? How was it all formed? Like, how did you get to where you at right now with the rap career? I ain't gonna lie, and I ain't gonna back to you for. I was never gonna be a rapper a day in my life. Shit. Nigga was playing with this shit at first. I was playing. Then it became with this serious. Shit, too. On first grade, it, it was my shorty Splack and my my baby brother, uh, baby Seven, who was really rapping for real. For who was really, you know what I mean, writing, going to the studio, paint, like asking me for forty, thirty, sixty to go to the studio for, and then. After I lost my shorty Splack on first grade, we had a we had a uh, a feature song together, me and Shorty Splack. And I sat there for like four days just listening to that bitch for and you know what I mean, first and someone just told me, Hey, get in the studio off my first song. I sat that to to the record label for they was fucking with me for now. So what was the what was the what was you dropped a song named Splack Gang, right? Yeah, oh God, that was my first song ever. Splat Gang. Oh, that one did numbers as well, too. Oh, God. So, what what happened to Splat? See, he was shot when I was about 16, for, you know what I mean? I'll be my shorty. Sorry to hear that. I'll be the guys, man. Guys. So... Have you have you been doing shows recently, or, or are you planning yeah, on just, doing shows? Yeah, I just had a show out at uh, Bahama Mamas and uh, up there. I think that was what up out east towards that. It, it's like a little uh, taco. I forgot what it's named, but it's like a nightclub out there. Post grade. But my biggest show so far, I, I think 
was we had some shit in Bahama Bombers for post grade. That shit was thumping on phone now. What song did you play like, over there? Uh, I did Splat Gang. Uh, I did a new feature I had with my shorty Ricks. Uh, my shorty Ricks and me just made a song. Make sure y'all go tune in to that too. For, uh, that uh, I think that one. We, that was the first time I performed it. I even dropped it. I performed it before I dropped it on post grade. But make sure y'all tune into that. And, and make sure y'all tune into my shorty Ricks on Food Now. So, how was it like for you growing up? See, growing up, like, it... I, had to become our daughter at a young age, man. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. You had to... You really had... Out here in Chicago, you really gotta know how to... Chill. Not really especially see, if you but, live in the trenches. Yeah, especially in the trenches, fool. You really gotta know how to move and like survive out here, fool. Like, I don't know, fool. A, lo- a lot of people see from the outside and it's like, oh, Chicago this, Chicago that, fool. But I ain't gonna lie, I love and hate my city, fool. Folks, great. So, like, can you elaborate on like what does the trenches like entail? Like the type of environment you had to go through. So, like. Especially on the dudes, for a lot of my older guys, for they they used to be in their own type of own type of you know what I mean world and shit like that. For whatever beef they used to get into, for and whatever situations they used to get into, for free all the guys. I ain't gonna lie, free every single one of the guys, for but you know what I mean they used to get into their own shit, for so I done seen a lot of dudes I was growing up with get shot right in front of my face, for and it's like it's hard to say that you gotta get accustomed. To losing your guys at the same time, not only to to death and shit like that, to shooting to like prison systems and full grave. Fucking watch, watch cops. There's dirty cops out there on full them. Like, the, but this is Chicago, fool. This is like shit. We gotta learn and like learn how to maneuver through fool. Fool them. Shit, sad. How was it like going to uh, school? Going to school out here, it, it's pretty solid, fool. Cause I ain't gonna lie. It, if you really into sports and stuff like that, folks, you can get somewhere, folks. You know what I mean? Like, my brother Dede here, he, he had a full ride going. So, uh, what school you was going to, Phil? Full, full now. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I don't even remember the school. Well, folks, God, he had a, yeah, my shorty blew his leg out on full now. But after that, you feel me? Folks understood, like, like we gonna make it regardless of the situation, folks, on full now. I knew, that shit was, I knew that shit wasn't gonna work, bro, because I was getting kicked out left and right. I ain't gonna lie. Folks, it was man. straight, like it was straight, it was straight fighting, nigga. That show niggas, like show niggas, you on top, on gang. Like it was like, for me, like when you go in that bitch, you gotta like prove yourself, damn near. And what you so was y'all like um, being like tested on a day to day basis since you said that? Basically, like nigga, when you walk in that bitch, it's niggas, it's niggas all in that bitch looking at you, nigga. It don't, it don't matter who you is. You can be buff, you can be skinny, nigga. You can be nigga, any type of nigga you is, bro. Niggas still gonna test you day to day. That county ain't no joke. Hold up. You been um, See, my, you been behind bars brother, before? Yeah, yeah, I'm fooling them. I'm lie. Like you get this is public information. That day anybody wanna go see this, I ain't. I mean, for, for, but my brother, he went in. I think a year before me, and I went in twice after him for, for first grade. Um, I had a little gun charge. That's about it. And uh, yeah, both my my my, uh, my situations with gun charges, I both beat first grade. But it's like inside the county, for you didn't see a whole bunch of shit, folks. And, and the thing is uh, about dudes out here, shorty, they like to make up lies about what going on going on in there, folks. So they they look better out here, folks. I know dudes out there, shorty. Who's get, I don't know if you ever heard about it. It's called the Glock Dookie on phone now. You ever heard about yeah. the Glock Dookie, shorty? I heard of it, yeah. All yeah, right, that... so I'm going to tell you, what a, I'm gonna tell you yeah. what a Glock Dookie is, folks. A Glock Dookie is some dirty shit on phone them. It's like, it's like phone them get, get gravel from outside, folks. He get Dookie from the toilet, shorty, on phone them. I seen the dude make this shit in front of me, folks. He get Dookie from inside, inside the toilet, shorty. Get gravel from outside in the yard, folks, right? And then right. boom. He he get pee from his next door neighbor, shorty, in folks gray, and he get he get bleach, all that type of joint, folks. Put it in a water Everything bottle. Everything in one. Everything, Everything in, in one. one. Put Dang. it in a water bottle, on folks gray. And when when the ops come through, shorty, shoot it out the water bottle, on folks gray, shorty. It's, like, not, it's not it's not even just the ops. It's like, not even it can, be, just it can be it can be the correction oh, officer. Gray. It can be anybody. Folks, you put your face up to the door, and folks gonna just folks, spray that bitch and, at you. And sometimes they don't even use water bottles. They use the shampoo. 
uh, you know, what I mean? shampoo. The shampoo they, they use the shampoo bottle. They use a fucking uh, uh the uh, what's it called? The Too Face. The Too Face shit. They string. They, sh- bro. Oh, folks, great. That shit. Squeeze that bitch. It's going straight. Squeeze hit. that bitch. Show. That's the Glock Bookie right there. That's why they call it the Glock. And, they can, and, and then it could be. It could be. Man, they could have HIV, all type of shit. On oh, broke grade. They still. Yeah. I'm folding up. Okay, so I, I don't know. I didn't know what it was a Glock Dookie was. Okay, so two different things. Yeah. Gotcha. Yep, that's All right. Glock Dookie right there. Oh, no. All right, so what do you think um, about other rappers like um, like saying they really do what they say in their music? Uh, how how do you... Yeah, yeah. Some niggas that be real no. niggas, but shit. And most of the niggas, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Look, fool. A lot of these rappers, bro, just be dudes who watch their uncle do something, or, or 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 heard about something on their block, folk. None of these rappers nowadays really be doing nothing, folk. It's all for an image on phone net. Like I swear to God, folk. Like it, it, it's sad, folks, because I I don't really like I don't really discipline my music, folk. You know what I mean, Shorty? I've been yeah. trying to get away from it, folks. So on 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 God, like I'm I'm realizing. How the how the industry works and stuff. I'm new to the industry. You feel me, Phil? So all like this, I'm trying to put behind me, Phil. But it's like when you wake up in the morning, you see you, you see a, a dude dissing your homies, Phil, and you ain't never heard a dude a day in your life, Phil. It's like, bro, we know about this in Chicago, Phil. Everything go around in a circle, folks. Who knew? Yeah, 